What's up, Duke fans? I'm Jay Spinks. I'm here with head coach Jerry Schmidt, head coach of the Duke and Dukes football team. 7-2 record overall, 5-1 in the conference, heading into this weekend's matchup against Sacred Heart. Coach, uh, what are you most excited about heading into this weekend's matchup against Sacred Heart, and uh, what's the emotion like uh, from the guys in the locker room? Well, what I'm really excited about is we had an opportunity to get a week's rest with the off week last week. Our guys worked really hard. Um, we got healthy a little bit. And uh, they've maintained their work ethic, and they're excited about finishing this season, especially about this week. Uh, our guys have done a real good job of playing one game at a time and keeping focused. Coach, having been labeled earlier this week to have a first place uh, in the conference along with Albany, what does this mean for Duquesne football as a program and Duquesne athletics all together as a whole? I'll tell you what, we have a really great group of young men on this football team that understand and respect the tradition here at Duquesne University and especially with the football program. They're excited to be where we're at right now. Um, they're looking forward to this week's game, getting on the field again. Uh, the recognition is, is warranted from the hard work they've done through the offseason all this year. And they understand uh, the impact of the, this football game coming up and they understand that we have to take it one game at a time. And they're a great group of guys. I'm, I'm so happy for those guys, proud of them. Looking forward to getting back on the field. And uh, Jay, you've had some games up there at Sacred Heart, and you remember some of those games. And I remember you catching, what, five or six balls one game. And um, we got a history up there and uh, doing some battle, and we're excited about it. Thanks a lot. Uh, you know you're interviewing the football coach when it's uh, hard for him to smile a couple days before the game. Uh, thanks a lot, though, Coach Min, and good luck the rest of the way. Thank you, Jay. Appreciate it.